Hello everyone, welcome to today's talk. It is the 22nd of September 2022. At the last time I updated about the Ebola outbreak in Uganda, we had confirmed only one case. As per today, the number of cases has increased and the number of deaths has increased as well. As I talk, we have lost about 11 people already uh, due to Ebola virus disease. Uh, eight of these people died from the community and three have died from the uh, facilities, the health facilities. And we have about 25 people who have been admitted and uh, 19 of these 25 people are suspects and six are confirmed cases. So people are receiving treatment, uh, but uh, some people have died. Uh, this outbreak occurred in central part of Uganda and in a district called Movende. Uh, investigations are still ongoing to find out the real cause of this virus, like where it came uh, to affect the local people. The theory is that it could have come from our neighboring country, uh, which is the Democratic Republic of Congo. And then there are also suggestions that it might have originated within. So the information is not yet out to find uh, where it has come, uh, but it is really spreading in central Uganda, uh, in Movende district. And as I talk, uh, we have about 58 contacts. Uh, so numbers are increasing, uh, but uh, the health workers are doing whatever they can to save the people. Uh, Central Uganda is not where I'm staying. Uh, like people asked about uh, whether the recent floods are the ones that caused uh, the problem of Ebola in uh, Mugende. But it, that is not the case because the floods were in eastern Uganda where I'm staying. As I talk, I'm safe, uh, but we can't tell what happens in the future. Let's pray for the people of Mugende that God will see them through this uh, situation. Thank you very much for watching. I'll keep updating you on the situation of Ebola virus in Uganda. See you in the next video. Bye.